it's, a, it's not a palace, it's a palazzo. It's the uh, Palazzo de Normandy. Normandy palace. Normal palace. Did you put the mic on? It is. Oh yeah, gotcha. Good. No, I just lied to you. Where we went was the Palazzo Conte Federico. So it's Count Frederick Palace. And, and it's so basically them from like... 1700? I, I felt like they got they got it around the 1700s. Uh, 1800s. 17th century is when they acquired it. Right. This family has lived there ever since. And the guy that was standing there welcomed us. Do you want to come see my home? He said. Alright. So his brother is leading the tour. And they take they do tours of their house their palazzo and it's all like traditional and they have paintings on the wall from the 12th century they let them take the um, way back when they took one of the fortresses one of the towers and that's built into their home so craziness what do you think of the sandwich amazing Oh my god, so good. There you go. Eat it. Sliced almonds in there. It's good. Great. This is fried Pomodoro cheese with honey. Something else. The honey is good on it. And he still lived there. And like we got to go see the mom and dad's bedroom. Dad's 80. He's a race car driver. Still, he's 83. He still drives race cars. It's craziness. And now, switching gears to the sandwich, just so you know, it has basil, but it's pistachio basil because um, basil pesto is from Genoa, and there's a little competition between them. So yeah, it was interesting. It was interesting to think like that. That's I think the most interesting thing to me was that it's been in his family forever, and grew up in that house, still lives in that house with his brother. When he gets married, they'll live there. Kids will live there. It's kind of crazy.